Hi guys, it's Shelly here. Um, I just wanted to share a quick haul video with you. Um, I don't have much time. i got to go pick up my mom from work, so I'm going to go really fast. Um, I went to Michael's last night, you know, for their Thanksgiving Day sale so I could use their coupon and everything. And um, I also got some stuff from TJ Maxx and I think um, Joann's. Just, oh, there's Piper um, a couple days ago. Say hi. Say hi. Look right there. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> She's silly. She always thinks that there's somebody here, so she might bark a couple times. But okay, so I'll get started. Um, first, I picked up um, a couple uh, two-in-one punches. Um, which one is this? Um, I think this one is like the daisy chain or something like that, or something like that. And then. Um, this, the line order arches, and then I also got the um, snowflake one. I think this one's really cute, and I'm working on my December daily, so I really wanted to use that on it. And then um, I also got just one of these um, recollections journal pads um, that go with the whatever they're called, um, creative chaos things. And um, I'll try to flip. Actually, oh. One side of it's not open yet. <laughs> Did you just run into the wall? Weirdo. Okay, so. I love the little bicycles in this one, so that's why I got it. And the bright colors are pretty much all the colors that I like to use. So that's what I got. And then I decided, I kept seeing everybody show these stamps. And I love this one, obviously. When you stop believing in Santa, you get underwear. So it took me forever to find these at my Michaels, but they were only four bucks plus the... Um, 30% off your purchase coupon, so it's like next to nothing. And then I got the Christmas tree one, and then the one with all the holidays. And then um, their spell binders were 40% um, off plus my 30% off coupon. They ended up being $7.50. So, um, what's the name of this one? I can never find the names on here. Oh, duh. this one's the heart circles one. And then I got uh, Florida Lee squares. And then I got ironwork motifs. And I like this because um, this one and this one I'm going to use as snowflakes in my December daily, I think. And then I got um, lacy circles. And uh, labels 18. I really like this one too. It's pretty. And then uh, splendid circles. I got this one just because all the circles look different. So I thought it would be pretty versatile that way. And then uh, romantic rectangles. And beaded circles. I saw a card with this where on this large one, they put little buttons in all those little circles around the edge, and it was so cute. So I said I had to get that one. And then I'm working on some altered projects for Christmas for people. I'm going to make um, candy dispensers. And um, so you have to um, use mason jars and then... Um, like a wood box that has a drawer in it and stuff. So I'm going to replace the feet on my wood boxes with the Tim Holtz corners. And then um, I got some metal embellishments that I'm going to use to kind of dress up the sides and stuff with all my paper and everything. And then I got some little jingle bells 
I'm going to put on my December daily because I love Jingle Bells. And then I got the Martha Stewart Crafts. Um, oh, which one is this? Like Christmas Cottage or something like that paper line. So I got a few of the um, embellishments to go with it from Joann's. And I have this. <laughs> Pipey, you can't eat it, silly. Um, I got the paper <laughs> paper tape. Uh washi tape that goes with it and then I got the tag pad which it's not open so I won't flip through it for you but it's super cute and then um oh I also got the um little tiny puppy stickers I love these these are so cute and then I also got some little pine cones those are really cute too. And then I just got some tags and stuff because I was um, thinking about like entering into some like tag swaps or something. So I figured I better get a few that I don't have to make myself so that I can kind of knock them out a little faster. And then at TJ Maxx, um, I ended up getting, I think I got these at TJ Maxx. Or these might have been in the dollar bin at Joann's, but the velvet ribbon and stuff, these are so cute. So I'm going to use those for some Christmas cards and banners I'm making and um, my December daily. And then um, they had these stamps there. They have them there all the time, but they want $3 for them at my TJ Maxx. And they're teeny tiny, and there's no way I'm paying $3 for these stamps. So I waited until they put them in the clearance section. They were only 50 cents and stuff. So I ended up getting um, three of the Happy Thanksgiving one. This one, three of those. So I'm going to put them in like some racks or something like that. And then I also picked up these two stamp sets from Inka Dinka Do. Um, they were only a dollar fifty, and I thought they would be like cute stamps for tags and stuff, like a double stamping technique and stuff. And I thought these were really cute for labels, like where you put your sentiment on a card or something. And then I um, had Joann's. Their um, stamps, clear stamps, were. 40% off or 50% off and then I also had a 25% off my total purchase coupon so I got this one and it's really cute um, the things that it says I'll read them to you it says all you need in life is a friend who has chocolate and then there's happy birthday and how many fingers are you and then um, you make me smile all over my face I love that one and then if you're feeling blue try painting yourself a different color and then Getting married means sharing your toys, which is hilarious. And then the last one is count your rainbows, not your thunderstorms. So I think that's those are really cute um, sentiments for cards and things like that. And then um, my mom, she likes to uh, close all of her envelopes with, like, cute stickers and stuff. I don't know. It's kind of weird. But she loves butterflies. So I picked her up, like, ten packs of butterflies. And I thought these were cute. They've got like little sequins on them and there's a ton in there. And these were all on clearance in the sticker section. So they were $1.50 plus like 80% off. So, you know, you can go wrong. And then I got these too. They're a little puffy, but not quite. They're kind of like jelly feeling. And then I also went Copic Marker Crazy last night. Um, I have the 72 set that's, I believe it's set B, and, um, so there was, like, a ton of markers I didn't have. The, um, set B only has one purple marker in it, in the whole set, and it's a super, super light purple, but whenever it dries, it's almost, like, grayish, so I had to get a ton of those, but I ended up getting 36 new Copic markers because you could use your 30% off coupon. So I'm super excited. And I asked for a bunch of um, like, oh, 
here's half of them. And, um, sorry, getting sidetracked. I'm trying to check the time to make sure I leave on time. Um, and then here's the last of them. But it took me forever to go through the box because my Michaels does not keep them in, like, color sections. They just have them all thrown in a box, and you have to, like, dig through them. So it's kind of a pain in the rear. But so that's what um, my stepdad got me Copic markers for Christmas, obviously, because there's no way I could afford 36 markers at one time because they're so expensive. Um, and then let's see here. I Here's the Martha Stewart paper collection that I got. I love this. It's so cute. Oh, and it's double-sided. Love that paper. Okay. And then also at TJ Maxx, um, they had a bunch of Kane Company um, paper pads, uh, the 12 by 12 for only five bucks. So I got this one, and I'm sure you guys have all seen this before, so I'm not going to flip through it. But my cousin, she loves these colors. And so her candy dispenser that I'm making is going to be decked out in those colors. So I'm sure she'll love it. And then I never, ever buy the um, Color Core cardstock because it is so expensive, and, I mean, I can just do without it. Um, sanding it down and the white showing through is okay with me, even though, you know, you can get it so that it's purple on the inside or yellow on the inside and stuff that it's just, it's too expensive. So, um, I got this because it was on clearance at Michael's last night. This is the only one they had left and stuff, so I picked it up, and there's the colors, and I have, like, two or three, I want to say three different Tim Holtz paper pads, so I'm hoping that, you know, these colors pretty much match all those paper pads, so I can use them, and get started on some, like, boyish albums, so that's my haul, everybody, and um, thanks for watching. I hope everybody had a happy Thanksgiving and stuff. I know I did. I ate too much food and shopped till I dropped, and um, I think that's it. Happy holidays, everybody.